So where is the intern coordinator? Upstairs, second floor, just past the classroom. Now hurry! Scanning for thinker print. Access granted. I'm really here! Psychonauts Headquarters! Ow! Sorry, new ball. Wow! <laughs> yep. Greetings, fellow psychic. I'm Otto Mentalis. Uh, I'm personally too busy crafting the future of psychotech. So much cool stuff in there. I'll come back later for the rest of it. <gasps> Excuse me, but do you know where intern orientation is? Second floor, past the classroom. Thanks. If you passed the restrooms, you went the wrong way. What, are we recruiting from kindergartens now? Running. Wow! Here they are! The Psychic Six! The group of paranormal experts Ford Crowler gathered together to form the Psychonauts. I read all about them in True Psychic Tales number one. Tragically, None of them were the same after fighting Maligula in the deluge of Grulovia. Less tragically, but still upsetting, my mom used that issue of True Psychic Tales to line the floor of the world's smallest horse trailer. There's Bob Zanotto, pioneer in human plant telepathy, and he's Lily's great uncle. Helmut Fulbert explored a synthesis of psychic powers in the arts. Sadly, he was lost in the Battle of Barovia. That's Cassiopeia, best-selling author of Mind Swarm, expert in extreme multitasking and mental compartmentalization. She claimed to have independent control of every cell in her brain, controlling them like a swarm of bees. Ford Crawler, the greatest psychonaut of all time, and a close personal friend of mine, I might add. Compton Poole, master of zoolepathy. If he's anything like his grandson, Dogen, he can be a little dangerous if he gets overwhelmed. Which is often. <laughs> Fellow agent. For now... Have you guys tried the new the smooth ultra beige low pulp stock? No. What's so special about that? It's double sided. Wow. What will they think of next? <laughs> Uh 
Uh-huh. Wow! You agents share recipes? You're just like us. Uh, yeah. Right. Recipes. Treat yourself to a psychic excess today. Hey, kid. You didn't take the toilet plunger, did ya? Shouldn't you be in class? Hi, I'm sorry. I just hate children. Wow! Psychonauts have their own hair salon? Would it be weird if I asked for the Sasha Nine? It doesn't look open yet, though. Titanium weighing you down? Let the automatic... Just like my nephew, a little jerk. Hey, look out! Oh, sorry, I didn't. Whoa! Ow! That's mean! Did he hurt you, baby? I'm not a baby. Yeah, you are. Question is, who's this new kid? My name is Raz, and I'm the new intern. That's ridiculous. I didn't ask for a new intern. Intern program's full. Sorry, kid. He is clumsy. He'd probably get us all killed. And he's mean. Well, kid, we give it a fair shot, and it looks like it just didn't work out. Better luck next year. Guys, quit picking on the new kid. We were all new ones, in case you forgot. I think he'll fit in just fine. In fact, I think he'll look cute in our uniform. Let's take him to the closet. Hey, you okay in there, Rusty? What's the holdup? It's Raz. I was just wondering, if there's an intern uniform, how come you guys aren't wearing it? Oh, well, we're level two. Now just hand out your clothes and we'll get you that uniform. Can't you hand me the uniform first? <laughs> no, silly. We need to take your clothes and measure them so we can get you a uniform that fits. Unless you want us to come in there and measure you. No, no. Here you go. Just hurry up, okay? It's cold in here and I'm practically naked. Uh-oh. Guys? Oh, come on! This is embarrassing in so many ways. to go shopping. <laughs> well, I can't leave this mysterious lost key just lying around. There's a narrow slot, but I don't think I can fit through it. Hmm. There's a narrow slot, but I don't think I can fit through it. Ah, uh, that 
supply chest is full of titanium, but my side pouch isn't big enough to hold it. I should get a bigger pouch in the automatic. I don't know the code. Rats! Oh, sorry, Harold. You're absolutely right. I should think about how I'm using that word. What is it, Harold? Do you know the code? Is the code in there, Harold? I'm too big to go in there. If only I could see what you see in there. Hey, that reminds me. Time to see the world as you see it, Harold. Once again, Harold, I found your perspective to be an essential contribution to the mission. Yep. Uh, oh no. Got him, right where we want him. Yet we still can't extract the information we need. Have you tried the Corpus Colossorator? Of course, no effect. Deep look. Sasha, you have to let me do more. You know it's because of me that... Otto. I mean, if I hadn't... Not a word, Rasputin, until I find you some new clothes. Sorry if the fit is a little off. They're the smallest clothes I had. Now, uh, tell us again how you ended up outside in your underwear. Oh, you know, I, I was sort of going undercover. Just like you did, Agent Mentalis, in True Psychic Tales number 62, when you used your defibrillator to hypnotize 16 trans troopers at once. Oh, please, that old yarn. Oh, they embellished so many details in that version. But in fact, it was 17 troopers. Well, love to chat, but uh, I gotta make like a brain and bounce. If you're ever looking for just the right tool for the job, come see me in my workshop. Even the best psychonauts require a little assistance now and then. Now, if you'll excuse me, Rasputin, I need to get back to the matter at hand. No, oh, no. I didn't bend the spoons, Mommy. Ooh, I love going through the car wash. Oh, and don't worry about the other interns, Rasputin. Initiation rituals are a common method for a specialized social group to integrate foreign elements while preserving the social exclusivity of that group. Understand? Uh, thanks, Sasha. Ah, Calagos. If you would just cooperate with our investigation. I know you're scared, but if you could just tell me who... No, 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 no more questions! Wait a second... Ugh, nothing. Sounds like it's quitting time. Hey, this is just like the brain tumbler you had at camp. Yes, but stand back. It's due for a thorough delousing. If I can ever get more power. Hey, kid. Oop, can't 
need this card lying around. That was a dirty trick you pulled. I want my clothes back. You know, you're right. I'm sorry. And I'm going to make it up to you. I'm going to let you finish my asset recovery mission. Why do I feel like I'm gonna end up naked in a closet again? My intern assignment is to track down this list of missing Psychonaut assets. Mission critical assets. So, like a scavenger hunt? If you think like a child, you will do a child's work. Finish this mission, and we'll know you're ready for your clothes back. I'm really late to intern orientation now. I'd better get to the class right away. So, What's going how's on? your fantasy football team doing? Uh. What's up, little guy? Nothing. Don't worry about it. Oh, sorry. Really? Yeah. Mm. I'm breaking my that heart. That person's aura is telling me their perspective on the world is especially worth seeing. With clairvoyance. Ow, you! It's the mole! Ha <laughs> ha! Just messing with you. off the market. Girl! Experts agree. It's just not safe to use what about Sasha and Mia? No. Without Definitely my special don't. clairvoyance enhancing bins. Sam, aren't you not supposed to tap the glass? No, it's the opposite. You're supposed to tap on the glass to keep their heart rates up. In this predator-free environment, their heart rates get dangerously slow. Huh. Plus, they love it. I mean, look at them jump.
think they should give the guy a real office. He hasn't tried to take over the world in days. Well, this has been fun, but it's getting late, and I should probably go. Almost had it. I just need to focus a little longer with my clairvoyance. All new interns, please report to my office for orientation. I don't have all day, new kid. Experts agree, it's just not safe to use clairvoyance without my special clairvoyance enhancing pins. With that side card, I can make a side challenge marker back at the automatic. Slot, but I don't think I can fit through it. Cut! I am me, my psycho mech battle bot is cut! Austerity is measures. Once I get my pirate radio station every department going, is affected. I'm gonna have a few. Not many DJ jobs open. Did someone say something about pirate radio? No. Yes. Morris is doing it, and it's totally against the rules, and he's gonna get kicked out of the Psychonauts. Lizzie, you're fired. Dream on. Can I be a pirate radio DJ? What's your area of musical expertise? Well, I grew up in the circus, so most of what I know is calliope music. I see. Looks like you don't need me anymore, Morris. Listen, I'll get back to you, kid. Get a hold of yourself, Oleander. Good luck fighting Maligula without my battle fight, cheap skates. Hey, I'm with you. <laughs> Letting him build a battle anything is probably a bad idea. Oh, right, new intern. Thought I told you not to be late. Doesn't matter. You need a mentor. Let me see who's left. Ooh, am I helping Mia or Sasha on a mission? No, you're in the mailroom. Your mentor is Nick John Smith. Mailroom? Nick John Smith? I've never heard of an agent John Smith. Nick's not an agent. He's not even psychic. He's just good at sorting mail. You'll love Nick. Everybody does. But the mailroom? Ford Crawler himself worked in that mailroom. You could learn a lot there. For one thing, how to be on time. Okay, I've given you fingerprint access to the mailroom. Now scoot, I've got a base to run and a budget to balance. I 
I didn't know you were a doctor, Agent Forsyth. I'm not. I dropped out after a year of interning at Our Lady of Restraint Neurological Hospital. I ran into some unfortunate roadblocks there. And when Truman Zanotto personally asks you to join the Psychonauts, you drop what you're doing and pack. Hey! Uh, how's your dad? Terrible! I gotta go get him some therapy plant stats. How'd you get that hatch open? Oh, it's got a fingerprint combination. I can teach it to you. Come here. It's more than just a number. You kind of have to feel it. Do you feel it? Yes. Good. Tell anybody you got it from me and you're dead. Bye! To side Oops. challenge markers with a psi core from the auto mech. <laughs> hmm, there's a narrow slot, but I don't think I can fit through it. Not card, miser. Combine your psi cards with a psi core from the automatic. A sweet severance package. Psy cards piling up, turn them into side challenge markers with a psy core from the automatic. I don't get paid enough for this. I'll tell you that twice. What's good today? Why do I bother making signs? Be 
a rank riser, not card miser. Combine your psy cards with a wow. psy core from the auto. Psychonauts have their own hair salon? Would it be weird if I asked for the Sasha? It doesn't look open yet, though. Psy cards piling up. Turn them into psy challenge markers with a psy core from the auto attic. Is this a bad time, Mia? I always have time for my kid ingenio. Can I ask you about the Psychic Six? Of course, Rasputin. Are any of them still around? Oh, yes. Besides Ford, you know, there's Otto Mentalis out in his workshop, still tinkering with his gadgets. Sasha is his number one customer. Dogen Bull's grandfather, Compton, is here as well, but he... he keeps to himself. The other survivors have gone their own ways, unfortunately. What happened to... Helmet Fullbear? Oh, that poor soul was lost in the Battle of Grulovia. I wish I could have met him. He seemed to have such a love of life. And color. Did you ever meet Cassiopeia? No, but I read her book, Mindswarm. Very inspiring. I'm actually using some of her multitasking techniques right now, talking to you while I work. Did you ever work with Lily's great uncle, Bob Zanotto? Oh yes, poor Bob. He lost so much in the battle, it really took a toll on him. I know it was very difficult for Truman to let him go, but it was getting dangerous. Oh, what that poor family has endured. Well, enough about those guys. Yes, let's talk about us. Are you worried about Truman? To be honest, I've never seen him like this before. But he's very tough, and he has his fearless daughter in there now, taking care of him. Are you worried about Maligula? Well, she died in the Battle of Grulovia, but sometimes the idea of someone is more dangerous than the person themselves. Her followers are what scare me. When someone devotes their life to a memory, they're capable of anything. Have you talked to Sasha lately? Sasha and I are always talking. Oh, he says hello. Are you meditating? In a way. I'm reaching out to detect ripples in the psychic network around the world. Ripples? A name like Maligula carries heavy emotional baggage for many people. It's like a large stone dropped in a pond. Ripples spread out, bounce off each other. If you know how to read the patterns, they can lead you to the source. What are you doing that for? I'm trying to find the illusionist activity around the world and report it to Agent Forsyth down in the nerve center. Well, I'll stop bothering you now. Never a bother, darling. Ciao. Bad fish. Knock it off. Guy. What's up, little guy? Hey, kid. 
Whoa, kid. Everything okay here? Should be. Because skateboarding is not a psychic crime. And I'm not arresting you. I'm just saying take it outside. <sighs> Fine. Well, okay then. Happy I could help. Are you guys still arguing? Nah, Frank's just telling me where all the good outdoor skate spots are. So you were saying something about a questionable area? Yeah, hopefully the funicular is running. Oh, sick. Hmm? Scanning for thinker print. Access granted. Mr. John Smith? Hello? I think I winged it. New intern here. How did Nick let it get like this? Okay in here? Who are you? I'm, uh, Nick John Smith's new intern. Oh, so you're the one not sorting all this mail. Wait! Better get all this mail sorted, quick! You're making Nick look bad. sort this mail if I'm going to ace this internship. is addressed to Truman Zanotto. Hey, this might be important. I'd better bring it to Truman. Technically, this heavy. Sorry, Truman. I'd better deliver this to Truman quick. Alley-oop! Ouch! That did some damage. Whoops! Here we go! 
precious cargo. Oops. Live with your brain, not your back. You guys gotta check this out. The new kid killed Nick. He's alive, but he's brainless. <gasps> what kind of sick monster would steal Nick's brain? I mean, Nick! Maybe he saw something he shouldn't have. But why keep his body alive? And why mail it to the Grand Head of the Psychonauts? It could be a warning. Hey guys, does the Lady Lucktopus Casino mean anything to you? Isn't that where we sent Agent 33? To investigate suspected delusionist activity? Agent 33 is two days late with her status update. I'll get the jet. I'll pack the go case. I'll stay here and protect the children. What? Aren't we all going on the mission? We could use you in tactical command, Agent Forsyth. And maybe the interns would benefit from... It's not safe. Not while we have a double agent among us. I'll take her place. I've heard the buffet there is shockingly reasonable. Well, if you reconsider, meet us on the jet pad within the hour. Can't we just... No, all of you. To the interns' bay. Now! I've got some training exercises planned today that are both informative and safe. Last one there has to delouse the brain tumbler. TV? I'll bet those guys took Nick's body back to the mail found. Yeah, I should go check and see if he's okay. He yeah. is my Access mentor after all. Granted. I don't think I need any more gadgets right now. Good, because I would never trust one to someone so young, of course. Denied. Uh, mm. 
Experts agree, it's just not safe to use clairvoyance without my special clairvoyance enhancing pins. available in my shop for testing. I, I mean for purchase. They're totally safe. Not available to interns, obviously. 